Hi everyone, my name is Chris King. I'm a sophomore in the College of Education. Today I'm just going to talk a little bit about uh, how to keep yourself organized and whatnot during these online courses. I know that a lot of students are complaining that it's a little hard to keep up with their all the emails they're getting from professors or whether or not they're, some professors are doing emails, some professors are posting online on D2L and whatnot. Um, so today I'm just going to kind of talk about how I keep myself organized and we'll go from there. So one of the things that I do is that every weekend, looking forward to the week coming after that, is I go through all of those emails that I've gotten, um, go through D2L and whatnot, and I organize everything that I need to do into a little chart. So this is really easy to make. You can just kind of make it um, go on Word, then do insert table and whatnot, do as many rows, columns, whatnot you need. Um, the way that I organize it is that I put... Well, I'll put the assignment on the day that I want to work on it, or that I have time to work on it, or the day that it's due. Um, my organization system for kind of keeping myself from being overwhelmed is that I do the work for the classes that I would have had on that day. So I'm not trying to do like all five of my classes on Monday and Wednesday and Friday. It's two classes Monday, Wednesday, Friday, three classes Tuesday, Thursday to kind of spread it out a little bit. Um, but this is a great way to keep myself organized, and if you want to use it, a great way to help keep yourself organized um, with all those emails that you're getting, all the different things on news. Um, you don't have to print it out either. You can keep it on your computer open just because I know that things change, so you can update it as you go. Um, it's just helpful to kind of print it out and then like post it wherever your workspace is. So like this is my workspace, so it kind of goes back up here. So that while I'm working on my laptop, I can kind of look up at it. Um, and yeah, so there's like my little organization system of making sure I get everything done. Um, another thing that I do on here is I even put like the random little things. So like I have which TV shows that I watch every week that I, that are constantly still going even during now. Um, but I would definitely recommend scheduling out your days even still. If you need to get down to it where you do work for your class that you would have on that day at that time, then do that if that's what works for you. But I would recommend scheduling out your day so that you don't feel stressed out and you don't feel overwhelmed by all this work. Um, you can just kind of look ahead and just be like, no, I do have, I will have time to hang out with my family or watch movies or read a book or whatnot after I do two hours of work this on Wednesday morning. Um, so just kind of schedule out everything that you need to do, schedule all the things you want to do, because that way you keep yourself organized, it takes everything that's up here and in your email and whatnot, kind of puts it in one place for you, um, and kind of reduces stress a little bit. I hope you all are doing well at home and you're doing well during these online classes. Um, have a great summer, enjoy the nice weather, get outside, walk your dog, go on walks, do anything that you can kind of keep yourself going during these times.